Welcome to more trades. Uh, this is another update on Solana. Um, I just was uh, wanting to update you more and give you more insight of what Solana has been doing for the past several months. We came down from this uh, 260 around 260 dollar range and we formed uh, bear flag after bear flag and they were all playing out. Even over here down at june lows uh when we started forming this rising wedge i had this target for solana 20 dollars and we came down to it almost exactly and uh after the breakout of this falling wedge if you look at this we formed some sort of range with one point here second point here and a third point over here some sort of parallel range uh, not perfect but it's a range anyway uh, the width of the range measures to give us a, a price target of $14, which we came down to and exceeded. And at the moment, we are just there at that $14, which is the measured move of from the peak over here of around 38 to the low over here of 26. That is about uh, $12. Uh, so from 26, take 12, that gives you 14. And at the moment, and that's what's happening with Solana now. We we had a spike down over here. This is on a large time frame on the daily. We had a recovery. <clears throat> we are ranging. We need that move up. We need to see Solana to move up. We will have a relief rally, but will that last or will that just take us to recover the previous wicks or candles or vector zones or whatever? Uh, to show the strength of Solana, this is on the daily. Solana needs to get above 38.6. This is on the daily time frame to show some strength in it. It needs to at least get above the 18.8 to say that we're breaking out of the range. We saw that in Dogecoin today. Dogecoin has broken out of the range and might possibly have higher targets for Doge. On the four hourly, looking at this... Uh, parallel range we're just at the top of the range we're stalling um, at the top of the range so that's uh, not very good for solana we might show some strength when the uh, weekly candle closes uh, i just wanted to uh, remind you all that it's a weekly candle close and we might see some volatility uh, if you haven't already smash the likes and subscribe to the channel and click the notifications and post your comments and all the good stuff so yeah we are arranging at the point of control a lot of these coins are ranging at the point of control at a point of resistance at a breakout point where it's uh, do or die uh, uh, it's not saying they'll go to zero but they're a critical critical decision point we need to be aware that on tuesday wednesday thursday and friday of this week there'll be big news events wednesday will be i think the biggest wednesday and thursday wednesday will have fed chair jerome powell speaking that will be a big event and then i think on uh, thursday we have uh, uh, some so many news announcements um, um uh, what do you call them so many um uh, um uh, things like the Schultz report the cpi uh, there'll be many of them on uh, thursday i believe but tuesday wednesday thursday and friday will have all news events so this week is going to be a big news play so there'll be a lot of treachery and uh, the markets i doubt that the markets will trend uh, easily and be easy to trade we won't find we might not find some chop but we might be trending one way during the, this beginning of this trading week. And then towards the end, we might switch directions. All depends on the reports, uh, the CPI reports, uh, um, uh, the Jolts reports, uh, Jerome Powell's tone of speech when he speaks. And after he speaks and he starts answering questions. So all these things will be being, playing a big role. Uh, big role so for now solana is at a point of support which is also resistant at the poc we are retesting it but we aren't able to bounce off it this poc is previous resistance 
This is on the four hourly. So this is big resistance. It's a magnet. We're stuck into it. But if we release that we could even go up to on the four hourly, just looking at the chart, we could go up to $16 or even the value area high at 15.5. So uh, yeah, we will, uh, we will see what happens during the weekly candle close. Will we release to the downside or to the upside? Just secure your profits with stop losses in profits. Uh, that's all I have for now about Solana. Smash the likes, more trades, I'm out.